Welcome to Scanning TV on YouTube once again. Let's see the latest updates coming in from the camp of Black Stars players, Baby Jetta Samwajan, and some other ones on this channel for you. Inyaki Williams, yes, you watched his first goal that he scored for the Black Stars team in Kumase against Madagascar. And he has spoken on his journey at the Black Stars team so far. Um, well, he has reviewed a lot and we'll talk about it in this update. Before then, i also share a video for you on Inyaki Williams. Nico Williams and their mother. In fact, the kind of food that these boys are actually eating and, and you actually enjoyed that video. We also speak about top five Ghanaian players who are scoring a lot of goals in Europe this particular season. We will check about that in this update. Then, Baby Jester Samojan today, um, he spoke on Asempa FM. I've brought you the extended um, version of that interview on this channel. We also picked some few points from it. How to build a Black Stars team again on John Pinto, on new striker for the Black Stars, and a whole lot of stuff. We will talk about all those ones and some more updates. You know how we do it. Anytime you join us, take your time and like the video for me. After liking, if you are new, subscribe to this channel, put out some post notifications so that anytime you drop the latest update, you'll be the first person to get and also enjoy. Enjoy. Leave your thoughts and comment in the comment box. Today, I'll give shout out to all those who commented under the last video I uploaded yesterday because I said it that yes, I'm going to give shout out today and I'll do justice to that. After watching the video, please don't just leave, share the link for others to also come and enjoy the details on this channel. Now, let me quickly begin from here. Before we talk about Inyaki Williams' latest interview and what he has to say, let's watch this amazing video that he shared. On his official Instagram, um, I would say, um, story today. Um, eating fufu with the junior brother Nico Williams, who plays for um, that is Spain, and the mother. And you know, the conversation was really interesting. Let's check the video out after that. We'll talk more. Who be the fufu? Who be the fufu? Power! And cut and quiet. Rasta man. Power. <laughs> 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 yes, so that is it from Inyaki Williams saying that yes, they are eating fufu, they are charging themselves. You know, they've been saying that yes, they eat fufu a lot, and that is what actually gives them power. So you can see that on the video, they've put in some battery over there, then the Ghana flag indicating that yes, they are eating fufu to charge themselves. And if you look at the size of the fufu in front of Inyaki Williams, that he was actually talking about his brother. In fact, the size of fufu wasn't easy. I thought like they were all going to eat the one fufu which was in front of Nico Williams. But I saw Inyaki's own and I got to realize that come on, all these fufu, fufu, then um, in Katin Kwan. Why, you know, yes, it is really interesting with some chicken and other stuff, you know. So, yes, so that is it. Now, let's quickly delve into the details and talk about Inyaki Williams' latest interview. Before then, as you know, already, Inyaki Williams he decided to play for Black Stars in the year 2022 ahead of the FIFA World Cup. That is when he switched nationality from Spain to join Ghana. But his junior brother, that is talking of Nico Williams. He still plays for the um, Spanish national team. So they are two brothers that they play for different national teams. And that is that. After he joined Ghana with all the competitions that he's played in, with the friendly matches and all, he's played about 17 games. And unfortunately, he has scored only one goal. The player feels worried, but he says that, yes, he thinks everything is in place. And making a decision or taking the decision to come and play for Ghana, he will never regret it. He says this on Club Del Deportista. That is where he actually spoke. He said, I would never have imagined this. I had to make a decision and I don't regret being able to represent the country of my parents and my family. To go back to my origins, to be able to travel more and see my loved ones in Ghana. Um, he continued to say, it is true that things didn't work out as we would all hope. But it is true that um, on a sporting and personal level, it helped me a lot. In fact, I think I'm on my best uh, moment. 
thanks to the decision. So that is according to Inyaki Williams. He says that he thinks that this is the best moment that he's actually experiencing in his life and thanks to the decision that he made to come and play for Ghana. This season, he has already backed 11 goals for Athletic Bobao. And I've been saying it, Inyaki Williams is not a bad striker, just that Ghana... We are not playing to seal team. We are not using him so well because um, for the past five to six seasons, he has been playing as a right winger. Usually, that's where he plays and he tries. But sometimes, Ghana, he will come and he will be leading the lines as a lone striker. And our midfielders are also not serving him enough. And that is the decision that our, our that I'll say that's the situation we are facing at the moment. But I think he still got it and he can still do a lot for Ghana if Otto Ado is able to utilize him very well in the coming games. Ghana will play the next game against uh, Mali in June 3rd. World Cup qualified. Let's see how things will pan out on that front. Now, let me move on and talk about um, Asamoah's own. They will come to top five Ghanaian players scoring a lot of goals in Europe this season. And you actually love it. But most of them are also not playing for the Black Stars team. And that is a big worry because we need goals in the Black Stars team. Asamoah today, he spoke on Asamoah FM. I brought you the extended interview on this channel. So if you have not watched it, after watching this video, please watch that one on this channel as well. So that you, you will not miss anything that he said. But let's pick some of the key points or some of the key things he said in the interview today. One, um, he actually backed Coach Otto Addo. He said that, yes, he's been with the team before and he has now returned. So, all Ghanaian should actually back him with all the support that we can so that the man will succeed. So, um, we don't have to say that, well, we are not going to back him. We are going to work against him. We are going to be against him. No, let's all try and help Otto Addo to succeed as the head coach for the Black Stars team. He also um, emphasized on the need that Mohamed Kudus, he should be the one that the team should be built around. Yes, he was asked about, um, you know, Blasters players who are performing in Europe. And he said, yes, Kudus, by far, he is the best Ghanaian player performing in Europe and even Africa. And, um, you know, so we have to support Mohamed Kudus and try to build the Blasters team around. He spoke about the generations, his own and some other ones. And he actually said that Kudus, at the moment, he's playing so well and we need to build a team around him. He also made mention of Thomas Partey's um, super talent. He said Thomas Partey is a generational talent. And um, he's actually saddened that injuries has not been good for the player. And it is true, Partey, anytime he is fit, we all see what he does for the team and the Arsenal team as well. So, yes, he spoke about Thomas Partey and also mentioned one striker when he was asked about the strikers, he think that they are going to succeed him in the Black Stars team. He said, well, not about succeeding him, but he spotted some few talents. And just the recent player, that is Jerry Efriye, who played for the Ghana under 20 team. He feels he's a very good player. His movement on the ball is good off the ball too. If he is able to work on some few things, the ball can be a great striker. So we should also watch out for Jerry Efriye and some other things that he said on the show today. I think it was great conversation. I enjoyed it myself. Off. so you can also check the video uploaded on this channel and watch the full one for yourself now let me talk about top five Ghanaian players who are scoring a lot of goals in europe this year and it is really interesting the one leading is none other than our own mohammed kudus yes kudus um this is he's he's done a lot and for western united he scored 16 goals mind you he didn't start uh, for both both West Ham and Ayas, I beg your pardon. He didn't start a lot of the games for West Ham when he joined initially, but later on he walked into the team and now he's commanding starting place. He began at Ayas and moved on to West Ham. 16 goals in all so far for Mohamed Kudus, um, and that is it also for him. We also have Ragnar Achi. This boy, I'm yet to speak about him on this channel. He's a German born, but of Ghanaian descent, and he can also play for Ghana if he decides to. And this season, he has also backed some 15 goals for his side, Kaiser Slotten, in Germany. So that is a German born Liga too, Kaiser Slotten. He has scored 15 goals for them. Kudus is leading him with one goal, so let's see how it will go in this season. The third player with most goals as a Ghanaian in Europe is Bernard Tekpete. Bernard Tekpete, yes, he plays for Dodogres Rasgard in Bulgaria and he has also been playing so well. I don't understand why this boy has not been given any chance for the past about 3-4 years because he has been playing so well, playing in Europe and doing a lot, but he is almost always overlooked. So yes, the number of games, Kudus has played 36 and scored 16. 
Um, Kaiser Sorensen's Ragnar Ache has played 22 games and scored 15. Ben Antekwete has played 33 and scored 13 goals. Then the next one is Inyaki Williams. Inyaki Williams, he has played number of um, 31 games and he has scored 11 goals, as I said already on this channel. Then the fifth player is Brandon Thomas Clark Michael Asante. This boy, um, we know that he was named as provisional man squad in the Ghana team that we used for the AFCON, but later on he was not selected. He has also scored 11 goals this season in some 35 games he's played for West Bromwich Albion in the English Championship. So these are the top five Ghanaian players in Europe this season who have scored most goals. One, Mohamed Kudus with 16 goals. Two, Ragnar Achi with some 15 goals. Bernard Tepete with 13 goals. Um, Inyaki Williams with 11 goals. And Brandon Thomas Clark Michael Asante with 11 goals as well. Let me know your thoughts in the comment box. Now, before I take leave of you, let me give a shout out to all those who commented under the last video uploaded on this channel. Shout out going out to Blueview Capital. I appreciate you so much. Blueview, thank you for being here always. Um, then I have Oscar Kezi. Thank you for being here, Oscar Kezi. Um, Elijah Nana Sante is also here. Thank you for being here. S. Romani Eric, thank you for being here. I appreciate you. Stanley GH is also on this channel. Stanley, thank you for being here. Baba Ojaki is also on this channel. Azuma Obe, thank you for being here. Um, then I have Ernest Ametefio. Thank you. I appreciate you. Barak says 365 is also on this channel. Um, then I have um, who again? Okay, Munal Isaac. Thank you for being here. For being here. Yes, I've seen you. Munal Isaac. Thank you. Justina Semenyo. Yes, Semenyo is also here. Thank you. I appreciate you. Eric Agbetsiafa. Thank you for being here. Um, Ima8485. You're also on this channel. Opokua Grace. Thank you for being here. Opokua, I've seen you. You are doing well. Soba Joseph is also on this channel. Thank you for being here. Aferi Foster. Thank you, Foster Aferi, for being here as well. And the other fantastic guys. Uh, so these are all the comments I had under the last but one video on this channel. Let me know your thoughts in the comment box. Don't forget to always like the video for me. Subscribe. Put on the bell for more updates on this channel. This was Kenny TV. And of course, we shall meet later.